I am continuing reading and playing my method for soprano desk and recorder. We are at the number 525. There are duets, so I will record one voice and after the second and then put in the two sides of the, the balance, left and right. So probably with that phone, I think that you can play with me cancelling on avoiding one of the voice. The 525 is a, a famous Christmas melody. Tu scendi dalle stelle ore del cielo. Six sweet, six eights. One, two, three, one. And then 526, a Czech dance. I wrote and published a lot, nine or ten of this Czech dance many years ago. Uh, Czech is just my idea. I'm not sure that the music is Czech, but I was uh, interested in the Czech world and the Czech music. So I wrote this dance. Not easy. One, two, three, four. The problem with unusual time signature like this one below is that they are asymmetrical and for this reason it is difficult to memorize the structure of each bar. 
when uh, here the rhythmical structure is one two one two three one two one two three i tell this because it could be one two three one two one two three one two if i make for example with the arpeggio this is one two one two three the opposite is one two three one two one two three one so in your head you have to remember this one two one two three one two one two three one two especially for playing the bar in which there are few notes like the first four bars of the second voice one two one two three one two one two mistake but in this piece the, the rhythmical structure is structure is the most important and now we are reading about chapter 15 last notes tonality modality syncopation ornaments <laughs> alternative theory there is a lot thing together in this chapter we are going to learn a note that occur very unfrequently nevertheless it could be interesting and may also be necessary to know how to play them. For some of these notes you need to close the hole at the end of the recorder with your leg, so I suggest that you try these notes sitting down. When you have mastered them you can also try to play them standing up, bending and rising a leg when necessary. Be careful of your teeth. This movement is easier with an alto recorder because the soprano is too short and the tenor is too long, but you will find the best solution for, your, for you by trial and error. In teaching you the fingering for this note, I have used number. Number 8 is the hole that has to be closed by your leg. For example, the C, higher C sharp, is like an higher D, zero half zero one three four six and eight this is d and this is c sharp with my tenor in this moment i need to make half zero one three four half six but for example with soprano 
it will be normally it has it's written the D sharp or E flat zero two three five six I'm sorry you have to check in the different octave with your instrument if there is exactly the note of what you are looking the E natural half zero two three five six eight is the octave higher of this then there is F half zero one two four five Eight. Ah, and this instrument doesn't work. We will see in this one. No, it, it's really this finger is dependent on the instrument. Ah, yes, I was the wrong, the wrong finger. Alf 0, 1, 2, 4, 5, 8. And I, F sharp not you will never meet, but we are at the end of the book. We can try 0, half 2, 4, 5. No, and this instrument doesn't work. In my in my soprano it doesn't work, but it works in my contralto. We will see. And then the last one is easier. Zero one four. C G E C. Uh, there is no really theoretical. I will not play. This uh, the exercise 528, 532, 3 because it's impossible to listen it. I will play 534. little to play this note so high it's a little theory more no not theory it's something that you do it's very very difficult but when you are able to play this so high note you will uh, manage better the medium high note that until yet it was difficult for you these are so new one are so difficult that the note, the older one, will be easier. And 535 with F sharp. Oh, F sharp is a note that seems doesn't exist here. I use a, an, another finger in 0, half 0, 1, 2, half 3, 4, 5, 6, half 7. This is an interesting when um, um, fingering written in some paper, paper uh, method uh, or that you find on the internet doesn't work. You have to try another one and to check them. And uh, the the 
536 probably will be more easy. And then 537. I'm sorry. As you can see, I'm not so able in this note, but there is note. C sharp is a note that you will find in many music. Uh, D, C sharp, and sometimes E flat, but the other one is absolutely theoretical in theory, but not in the practice. The last one, I or G, is something that exists in a sonata from Telemann. Okay, I hope it's been helpful. <laughs> it's not so easy, but helpful.